അമേരിക്കൻ മലയാളികൾക്ക് അമേരിക്കൻ രാഷ്ട്രീയത്തിൽ പ്രവർത്തിക്കുന്നതിന് അവസരം നൽകുവാൻ നോർത്ത് ഹോംസ്റ്റെഡ് മലയാളി ഇന്ത്യൻ അസോസിയേഷൻ രൂപീകരിച്ചു ഉദ്ഘാടനത്തിൽ ന്യൂയോർക്ക് ഇന്ത്യൻ കൌൺസിലർ ദേവദാസൻ നായർ ന്യൂയോർക്ക് സ്റ്റേറ്റ് കൺട്രോളർ തോമസ് ഡിനപോളി യു എസ് കോൺഗ്രസ്മാൻ തോമസ് ഡിസൂസ തുടങ്ങിയവർ പങ്കെടുത്തു പുതിയ സംഘടനയുടെ ഭാരവാഹികൾ ചെയർമാൻ കളത്തിൽ വർഗീസ് പ്രസിഡന്റ് ഡിസിൽ ജോർജ് വൈസ് പ്രസിഡന്റ് തോമസ് ചെറിയാൻ സെക്രട്ടറി ആഷ്ലി എബ്രഹാം ട്രഷറർ ഫിലിപ്പ് ജോസഫ് എന്നിവരാണ് ചടങ്ങിൽ ന്യൂയോർക്കിലെ വിവിധ സംഘടനാ നേതാക്കളും സാമൂഹ്യ പ്രവർത്തകരും പങ്കെടുക്കുകയുണ്ടായി you all here tonight as we officially launch the North Hampshire Malayali Indian Association an organization in mission station in mission to get our community especially the second generation involved in our local politics and be a voice to those in leadership position thank you mr chairman for your warm welcome Up next is the most awaited moment of today that's the inaugural ceremony of North Hampstead Indian Malayali Association A new organization is being formed and I have been invited and proud to be here because the organization happens to be the about the uh, about the community members formed by the committee members of kerala a state from where i belong in a democracy how is it united is power you have power if you are united unite unity gives you strength uh, this is our mission statement uh, north Hems- north hampstead Indian Malayali Association is a non-partisan meaning we're not advocating for any party or for any candidate or a non-profit civic engagement organization in North Hempstead New York which seeks to engage educate and empower the Malayali Indian and South Asian American community to build a just and inclusive society Nehima seeks to encourage individuals and leaders in the Malayali Indian and South Asian community to be proactive in our democracy to achieve equal access to resources and opportunity for full and inclusive political participation with all of you at this grand inaugural day of North Hempstead Indian Malayali Association North Hempstead Indian Malayali Association as the name speaks for itself surely it takes us back to the southernmost state in India known as Kerala which is also known as God's own country North Hempstead Malayali Indian Association how proud to have this organization in our great town why because it means that there are a large number of Indian Americans who live in our town you make our town stronger you make our town better you add to the diversity and the beautiful tapestry that is our town of North Hempstead and we are so happy and joyful that you were with us. So I was I'm in the United States Congress and I served on the Armed Services and the Foreign Affairs Committee and I recently traveled to India and met with Prime Minister Modi and the Foreign Secretary and a whole bunch of other people while I was there and I want you to know something. I am convinced that the most important ally for the United States of America for the next 50 years is going to be India. Namaste. So, I did a little bit of research about the Malali. 38 million all over the world. About 34 million of that in India, but like so much in our global world, there's a diaspora. And in the United States, there are about 100,000 Malali here. So, I just wanted to introduce myself to those of you who don't know me as your county executive. I am here for you and I'm so happy to be invited and to be part of this wonderful program 
Congratulations to the honorees. Honorees went to Tom Swazi to present the congressional citation and Laura Corrin to present the NASA County citation to Dr. Naidu. And congratulations, Dr. Korean. Congressman Tom Swazi will be presenting the Congressional Citation and Laura Curran will be presenting the NASA County Citation. Congratulations, Dr. Lori Thomas. Once again, Tom Swazi and Laura Curran with the citations. Congratulations, Captain Stanley George. Once again, the whole team here. Congressman Tom Swazi, Laura Curran with the citations. I congratulate you for all your achievements, but I know this is a community that prides themselves in working hard and achieving their goals. May you always be examples for your children as you are tonight. Thank you here this evening and uh, thank you uh, and congratulations to all of uh, our awardees tonight.